And let's try a non-monic as well. How do I solve this by completing the square? Well, exactly the same method. Write the zero on the left first so that you've got lots of room to expand. Um, put the four outside. X squared divided by four, three X divided by four, a quarter. Now to complete the square, give yourself plenty of room. Minus three X, put the quarter way over here and leave lots of room. To complete the square, I need to have half of this squared. Always add 3 on 2 squared. But if I've added 3 on 2 squared, I better subtract 3 on 2 squared. Well, this part is x minus 3 on 2 squared. This part is minus 9 on 4, plus 1 on 4. OK, so x minus 3 on 2 squared minus 9 on 4 plus 1 on 4 is negative 8 on 4, which is 2. Here's my difference of squares. 4 times, um, I don't actually need that. Um, let me try doing it without the brackets. X minus 3 on 2 plus 2. X minus 3 on 2. No, sorry. Root 2. That's better. Minus root 2. Difference of square, so I need the square root of 2. OK. If I am solving this equal to 0, you can imagine this as minus... I'm going to go straight there. Therefore, x is either, what am I subtracting? 3 on 2 minus root 2. Or, what am I subtracting? 3 on 2 plus root 2. And those are the two possible solutions.